for centuries. So, I'm going to give you a quickie here. Demo with a little noise. Now, you have to be very careful. This is half inch plywood. You don't go all the way through. Whoa! Somebody hold on to this. Okay, I quit. <laughs> now, I have lots to go. You will not believe. So, this is the perfect ex example of my obsessive compulsive disorder. <laughs> so this is, I could name these OCD, <laughs> but anyway, and it's so enjoyable. Now when you do about 50 of them at a time, it's really, it, it almost becomes strange music. <laughs> So these are trailer nails. Oh, I didn't tell you the rest of the story of trailer nails. Are they Quick. still make anymore? No. No. Just for him. No. Just for me. They don't make them at all. But what happened was the Anderson Independent uh, photographed the stair thing. And so uh, I took the newspaper article and I sent it to the company, Nichols Wire and Steel. And they then, uh, I realized, uh, they moved from Davenport, Iowa, to Huntsville, Alabama. Mm. Uh, they were even closer, but uh, uh, but anyway. So I so I sent it to Teresa, and oh, about two days later, Teresa calls me up, and she said, the boss saw saw this stuff, and he he wants one for our new building. <laughs> <laughs> And so I said, uh, I'd, I'd be glad to do one for you. Uh, tell me uh, how big the lobby is so I can make one the right size. And so then, uh, then the next question was, the boss wants to know how much it's going to cost. <laughs> I said, 200 pounds of aluminum nails. <laughs> I have enough nails to hand down to my grands, grandkids and they can hand them down to their grandkids, whatever it is they want to do. Okay, I quit all, uh, and I have, to, I have to admit that uh, art was my favorite subject in school and graduate, but the second was mathematics, so, and I've, I've never got, gotten over that, but so that will resemble Many, many of you may have seen these. This is in Greenville. This is at the Hyatt Hotel. This particular piece. And this is fabricated. This thing weighs, uh, I don't know, uh, somewhere between three and 4,000 pounds. So you have to have a crate. But there is a, a, uh, a metal uh, company in Greenville called Consolidated Southern Industries, CSI. So they made this for me, and this this model resembles resembles this one, of course, and this is black granite under underneath it. So, so that sits at the Hyatt Hotel. So I would like to find anybody interested in this. Uh, uh, one of our councilmen uh, is interested and has, has shown interest in the past, but it would be fabricated in Anderson, South Carolina. So it's not like we're doing something in Chicago and shipping it here. This is local. But my, the best thing for me was the men who made these, and this is another one I made. Maybe you've seen it by the river. Okay, they made this. But, but these men are marvelous. They would like me to move my studio into their factory. <laughs> and so, so anyway.